which of the following cannot be a multiple of a, b, c or d and it is given that integers are greater than 1. So let's assume values for which these expressions end up being multiple of one of these four variables. So let's assume small values for let's say b is equal to 2 is equal to c is equal to d and let's give a big value to a such as 50. C 50 upon 2 would be 25 plus C upon D is 1. So this would be 26. 26 is a multiple of 2. So option A can be eliminated. Here the value would be 24. This can be eliminated. Here whatever the sum is, it's going to be a big number. It's going to be something even and therefore it's going to be a multiple of B, C as well as D. So this can also be eliminated. A, B, C, D the product for any values, we know that a, b, c, d, the product will leave remainder 0 with a, b, c or d and then minus 1 will effectively lead to a remainder of minus 1. Since all the terms are greater than 1, a, b, c, d minus 1 cannot be a multiple of a, b, c or d. This is the right choice. a, b, c, d plus 10, again for this set of values we took as example, this sum is going to be something even and therefore this can be a multiple of one or more of these variables. Option E can also be eliminated. Option D is the right choice.